Well, hello, thank you for joining me today again on the Church History Trail. And where we find ourselves today is at Mosley Mill in County Antrim, just outside Belfast. And this is quite a unique place. I've really only discovered this um, this weekend because uh, I didn't actually know that it existed. Um, I, you can see a chimney there sticking up. And so certainly I knew that there was a mill here at one time, but I didn't realize that the mill had actually been completely uh, transformed. And you have the Antrim and Newton Abbey Council offices in here, but what you also have is a restaurant, you have a museum uh, dealing with the history of the mill. And just behind us there, that's a theater as well. Um, so, and the grounds around this is absolutely lovely. So, quite amazing. And you can see a wee sculpture there. Gives you a wee bit of the, of course it's well built up now, compared to what it was like then. Um, so I'm gonna just let you see the museum here because the museum's on the ground floor. But you can see it's some building. You can see the chimney sticking up there. And uh, it's great that they still have this chimney. Absolutely fantastic. So I'll take in and just show you quickly the uh, museum. Oh, yeah. So this is the museum part of the uh, building. As you can see, and that's Henry Campbell. Henry Campbell is a big association here, as well as the Grimshaws as well. You can see their museum at the mill. Not a very big museum, but uh, still good to have it. You can see some of the machines there. There's a lady working one of them. There's a gentleman working that one. So this is Museum at the Mill, People and Place. It's the Campbell's Lace Thread. So this is the other part of the museum. And the lights are off for some reason, but uh, we'll not worry too much about that. Gives you the history. And that's actually a Mosley House, which was built around 1815, has a home for the mill's owners. Um, standing slightly to the east of the mill. The estate included gardens, stables and a gate lodge. So uh, that looks pretty modern, so I assume that that house is still standing. Some of the workers. Back in the day. And there's a big room down here I'm going to show you. And you see that. A thousand looms come forth to clothe mankind. <laughs> That's some size of a room in there, isn't it? That's pretty big. And there's also a... That says June. That's, as you can see, it's the Royals. And it's 1953. And it says on it... If I can read it... Made... That was made this in 1953 to commemorate the coronation of our dear Queen Elizabeth II. That's Francis McGee. It's a locally made embroidered panel with linen, linen thread. So they are. Amazing, isn't it? So that was to celebrate the Queen's coronation. 
So what I'm going to do, I'm going to wrap this wee video up shortly, once I show you this other wee side here, and uh, then I'm going to uh, kick up the front, the front's absolutely beautiful, um, you have the chimney and all, I'll be able to show you the chimney, so watch out for that wee video. Some samples there. Industries of Ireland. So I'm going to just introduce you here. This is Nicholas Grimshaw. The Grimshaws were one of the first owners of the mill. And then this is the Campbells. It says the Campbells made their mark on Mosley between 1859 and 1978. And that's Garrett Campbell, Dermot Campbell, Lawford Campbell, and that's Nan Campbell. So there you go. So thanks for watching. And I hope you've enjoyed the video. And again, if you enjoy it, then if you enjoyed the channel, then please like and subscribe. God bless.